U.S. Options Market by www.options-trading-education.com The U.S. options market is currently rife with rumors. For example, calls on U.S. steel are up after the American steelmaker pulled out of a steelmaker conference and canceled a scheduled visit by an analysis to one of its mills. The largest integrated steel producer still buys most of its iron ore and does not own its own mines. Thus, the U.S. options market is speculating about a purchase of iron mines, or perhaps a merger or acquisition. The recent options trading volume of over 40,000 calls to fewer than 8,000 puts tells us that options traders are expecting good news for U.S. steel and a rise in stock price. What are call options? For those not experienced in trading options, a call option contract on a stock gives the trader the right to purchase 100 shares of the stock on or before expiration date of the contract. He pays a premium, the price of the options contract for this right. The trader will buy the stock at the contract price, not the higher market price, providing that the price of the underlying stock moves up. If the stock price falls, the trader is under no obligation to buy the stock. In the U.S. options market, contracts typically allow the trader to execute the options contract on or before the contract expiration date. These are referred to as American style options as opposed to European style options. European style options only allow the trader to execute the contract on the expiration date. Both types of options contracts are traded in U.S. options markets and in Europe. In both the U.S. options market and elsewhere, it is possible to buy and sell options contracts before the expiration date. As the price of the underlying stock changes, so will the value of the options contract. In order to profit, the trader does not need to execute the contract. He only needs to execute the opposite trade to exit his contract, hopefully with a large profit. The high options trading volume on U.S. steel is part of the U.S. options market response to rumors. Higher trading volume in both the underlying stock and in the U.S. options market tends to make technical analysis of price changes more accurate and is attractive to technical traders. Traders use the U.S. options market in order to hedge investment risk as well as to speculate on stock price changes. For example, mining companies, oil companies, and agricultural producers, as well as their customers, buy and sell calls and puts on futures on commodities such as gold, crude oil, or winter wheat. As with stock options, traders purchase calls when they believe that the price of the underlying commodity will go up. When to buy puts is when the trader believes that the underlying price will fall. As an example, a gold mining company may buy puts on gold bullion if they fear that the price of gold will fall. If the price of gold does fall, the company will exercise their option and sell gold bullion at the contract price even though the market price may be substantially lower. This is a common means of insuring against market risk in commodity production. For more insights and useful information regarding options and options trading, visit www.options-trading-education.com.